Hello. Today I will focus on focus, attention span. Firstly, everyone's individual. Everyone has different processing speed, focusing abilities. Yet, of course, it is helpful for learning. But I will note that some, for example, great artists take their time. Years to do a work of art, which ends up being a masterpiece. That's all right. So time doesn't necessarily matter. Of course, when you have lots of projects you want to do, or you're in school, it's nice to do it quickly. But again, the main thing is that the students say, if you're homeschooling your child, for example, they might need more time, whether it be their processing speed, their cognitive tendencies. Or the situation, or they might not like the topic, or they're tired, or it's the day, it's nighttime. Many, many factors are involved. But in general, attention span across the age groups has lessened with our fast-paced video edits and 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 short videos. The good news is that you can train yourself to increase your attention span again, and you can help a child increase their attention span. You just add a little bit each time to the duration of the study time, reading time.、Uh, one thing that I found in research that I did with the music education and how it transferred to cognitive ability. Is that focus increased? Teachers noted that, and it makes sense. Imagine you have to keep track of a song. I worked with seven-year-olds all the way. There were, there were different age groups, as young as five up to nine at different points in my music music education research with cognition. But the more that、um, one needs to stay on task, for example, if you're in an ensemble. The last thing someone wants to do is be the wrong person, or, the, or not the wrong person, but play the wrong note, or be out of rhythm, or come in at the wrong time. So the children, it increases attention span and focus ability very well, and which of course transfers to all subjects, helps with study time, and, and especially today, again with technology. I think we all need to work on it. I, there was a professor who, during the summer, she worked on her reading time、uh, focus span, and and by the end of summer, you know, she felt like she had got gotten back to a similar rate or、uh, duration ability. So keep in mind. So we all have individuals,、uh, skills or tendencies, and that's all right. But there are ways to improve it, such as. A, Learning music, or just increasing your attention span. You're working with your child, increase their study time, and so also speed of processing. That's an individual thing. There's also a time element.、Um, for example, when I was very young, teenage, I did mathematics contests, and they would give me、uh, multiple tests.、Um, Because it was fun to just be able to complete them so quickly. Now I'm much older, and I am slower in processing things. But I'm wise. I'm a lot wise. I have a, a lifetime of experiences to draw from. So speed does it matter? I'm not in a math contest right now. There's no need to quickly、uh, calculate. Although sometimes it's handy, but we have calculators now. But I find that the wisdom. Um, as we age, increases again, drawing upon so many experiences, learning experiences. So, again, speed of processing, duration of focus, those are helpful things, but they're not. They don't make the difference between a genius or a non-genius, and who cares anyway? For intelligence, it's not necessarily a measure of intelligence,、um, although it's a specific facet. That okay. Quick processing speed, great. So that's a facet of intelligence. But there might be other areas of intelligence that are much higher. So thoughtfulness is a positive thing. So again, 
if you or your colleague or your child are slower at something, that's all right. But we can work on it, and, and you can you can increase time if you put a little mild pressure. Uh, you can you can work on that either duration of focus or speed of processing. You you can you can work on that. But the main thing, take home message: we are all individuals. Secondly, we can work on these. We can increase. We can exercise the brain just like you would your body. It is part of your body. So remember that. Don't despair. Celebrate differences. And happy studying, happy learning. Have a lovely day. Thank you.